Hello everyone. I like to share with you a few trades posted on Tuesday, 23rd of May 2023. These trades were shared by HS, who is trading Dow Jones Industrial Average in form of CFD. As you see here, the macro chart currently at this time frame is in wide range sideways. We have a still a, a very large red candle that is showing downtrend, and you can see in five minute chart the trading channel that is going down and in the one minute trading chart when the price pullback completed and is aligned with the higher time frames you identify two areas of entry and entered and exit with exit strategy number one that you can see the positive results here so thank you hs for sharing your trades with us the next trade was shared by aa who's trading nasdaq cft as you see the macro chart is in sideways but it's showing a big green candle and you can see in the structural chart a wedge and uptrend is forming and is gaining momentum so using a tick trading chart we identified good area of breakout and entered here with setup c and managed this trade to close it with profit also the next trade is shown here by AA that is showing the price was going down when it broke the sideway channel and the structural chart is showing downtrend channel and using a tick trading chart he identified an area of entry and managed that to close it with exit strategy number one. Also when the downtrend gained momentum in macro chart you can see in a structural chart a clear downtrend channel so after completion of pullback and the break of this trend line when the seller came back he identified good area of entry and into two position and managed both of them to close with profit so thank you AA for sharing your trades with us the next few trades were shared by Yan, who's global instructor who's trading nasdaq futures as you see the macro is, is in narrow range sideways and you can see the volatility is very high in one minute a structural chart and anyway these candles with the five second trading chart was traded in both direction of short and long depends on the location with setup c and you can see the result of the day which was positive with profit factor of 1.21 and about 60 percent win rate and average win to loss ratio of 0.83 and the largest winning trade was 130 and the largest losing trade was 75 dollars so thank you, Yan, for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those I have taken during the New York market session, and the video with detailed explanation was sent to students yesterday. So I'm gonna replay the video here for you. Hello, everyone. I'd like to share with you my trades taken today on Tuesday, 23rd of May, 2023. These trades were taken on NASDAQ and Russell futures. As you see the market last day, and reached as high as uh, 13,980 uh, close to 14,000 and couldn't hold and during Asian and London session it started to go down and reach this point of control which is the previous day close and during the New York market session at 930 it went down a little bit it started to go up these candles and again this uh, level of point of control was tested and the price couldn't hold and it started to go down and we had several news at the beginning and market was very volatile as you see from these shadows here so I waited for the price to come down around this area around 10 20 and these red candles with big shadow and these next few candles here that were very choppy and sideways were traded with long positions mostly set up B and you can see the entry here with the setup B and order flow confirmation. And the same also, I traded uh, the Russell uh, long position. And we don't recommend novice traders trade uh, this jockey volatile uh, market. And they have to filter and stop trading when it's not very trendy and it's sideways with high volatility. So anyway, these signals from these charts were copied by copy trader to multiple Apex Trader fund accounts. And as you see, on average, we reached profit factor of 2.65 with 76% win rate, mostly from the long side. And the average win to loss ratio was 0.84. Uh, 
the largest winning trade was $255 and the largest losing trade was $134. So I hope these trades taken by the PAN system is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day.